And let me start off by saying, uh, if somebody in the real world is watching this hearing, they've heard every single person from the drug companies and from the PBM say, we are working tirelessly to lower the cost of prescription drugs, just knocking our brains out. And yet, at the end of the day, 1.3 Amer million Americans are rationing their insulin. People have died. People end up in the hospital. And you're all working night and day to lower the cost. And all over the world, people are paying a fraction of the price, not only for insulin, but for other products, drugs, than we are paying. So I'm going to, and I would appreciate very brief answers, because we don't have a whole lot of time up here. So let me start off with Eli Lilly, and I'm going to go down the line here. Uh, Mr. Rick, since uh, 1996, Eli Lilly increased the price of Umalog 34 times from $21 to $275, bucks. same exact product. I am told that it cost $5 to manufacture this product. And the story is not different uh, for the products uh, produced by uh, Novo and Sanofi. So my question to you and to the other drug companies, will you commit to this committee today that you will not increase the price of any insulin product again? Mr. Ricks. Uh, thank you, Chairman, for the question. Uh, as I mentioned in my comments, all we've Bre done Bre Bre is reduce the prices since I've been CEO. So I'm comfortable saying we'll, we'll leave our prices as they are for the insulins on the market today. All of your products. Yeah, in fact, we've been cutting them, is, is the point I'm making. You're not going to write it. Uh, Mr. Hudson. We've said before we have a responsible and sustainable pricing approach. We've had it since 2017. Net prices continue to fall, and the net price for insulin today for Lantus is lower than it was in 20, in, when it was launched in 2001. So I'm hearing from you that you will not increase the price of any insulin product again? To repeat myself, we have a responsible pricing policy, oh. the standard in the Yes industry. or no would be the better answer. We have a responsible pricing policy. We've set that since 2017. All 